everybody, my name is Sean. Welcome back to Sean Plays, and we're back with the exciting finale of Batman and Telltale Series. I told you guys last time I would beat this game the next episode I filmed. I finally had a chance to sit down and play. I've, you know, I've been working Black Friday. I've been doing all that fun retail stuff. Again, I'm not going to tell you where I work. Just know that I was working, and it was crazy. And now I can finally relax, so I'm sitting down, and we're going to finish this game, City of Lights. We've had some crazy twists and turns in this game, in this series. Um, like, who knew the Joker would have been in there? That was certainly a surprise. But, uh, you know, it's it's a good time. I'm, I'm excited to see where this Alfred. ends up, where this finishes up. Ooh. Lucius, it's Bruce. He's not here. Damn it. I'm going to search for clues. Just tell me how I can help. That's right, we're investigating the crime scene because Alfred was missing because I'm on my way. Crazy stuff is going on. Find him, Bruce. I wanna say it was no, Harvey's in jail. It was Lady Arkham. Lady we'll Arkham. Focus. Figure out what happened here. Yeah, because we got we got what uh happened to you, Al? We got Two Face. We got Penguin. Now we're now we're uh Trying to get Lady Arkham. And, uh, scuff mark. AKA, spoiler alert, Vicky Vale. This. But. Ash everywhere. And Penguin was still messing with our stuff, so we're, we're getting it back on. Uh, getting it back on uh, track. Because now the penguins out of the picture, we can finally get our stuff. Because it takes some time to boot Fred up our just stuff. Just scattered back. outwards from a single point. An explosion, maybe. Mantle blood. Broken shelf. What did you do to Alfred, you horrible woman? They oh, better not you have Alfred. touched Michael Caine. Or I'll be very upset. I don't want to bury big another one against this wall. Or it was my base. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, something. So maybe. Oh man, there's oh there's a busted base. Face was knocked over in the struggle. Yeah. Craziness. Fight left nothing untouched. It was a brawl for the ages, a clash of titans, if you will. Pool cue. This pool cue was used as a weapon. I hope Swing Alfred so was on you. It broke in half. Hoping Alfred's the one that caused that. Because. Blood spatter. Blood pattern looks like it came off a high velocity hit. So that's gonna connect to the. That's gonna. Okay, this is gonna connect to the pool here. Alfred Makes used sense. the pool cue as a weapon. Broke it across his attacker's head. Whoop! And that didn't stop him. He used the jagged end to stab him, spraying Good blood job, across Alfred. the whole table. Alfred's a boss. Uh, smash table and the smash lamp. So maybe I don't know. Is there something else I can do? Am I missing something? I feel like I might be missing a clicker, clicker, click, a, click, a broken lock. Oh, and there's fire poker. Oof. How the hell? Okay, I can't link it. Uh, let's look at the broken lock. So the there's nothing else in this here. Destroyed. Alfred yeah. must have barricaded himself in here. Good on you, Alfred. But they got in anyway. Yeah. Okay, so firebroker. Scuff mark. Okay, let's see the fireplace. There's ashes everywhere. Maybe it's the fire poker. Find out. I don't know. Could be. Could not be. Who knows? Alfred grabbed the fireplace poker to fend off an attacker. Yeah. But it was knocked away. Yeah. That makes sense. And now with the scuff mark and the bookshelf we really have. I think. I think that's correct. There's usually two things you wouldn't think that would link together. Lady Arkham must have used the concussion blast from yeah. her staff to try and stop Alfred. Yeah. 
I wish we'd put up a fight, though, I know though, what man. happened. Yes! The children of Arkham broke in. Alfred barricaded himself inside the parlor. He had just enough time to grab a pool cue as a weapon before Lady Arkham blasted the doors open. He broke it across one of their heads. Oof. And stabbed him to get away. Good job, Alfred. Good job. Another assailant tackled Alfred, knocking over the vase. Alfred Oof. almost escaped, but then Lady Arkham entered the parlor, used her oh. staff's concussion blast, scattering all the furniture in her path, throwing him against the wall by the fireplace. So Alfred grabs the nearest thing to use as a weapon to defend himself. Lady Arkham deflected Alfred's attack, causing the poker to fly across the room and lodge into the wall. More blood on the mantle. He smashed his face into it. Oh. Wait. That picture doesn't belong there. Lady Arkham wanted me to oh, find this. Oh no! You mess with Alfred, you mess with the bat. Oh, we're gonna take this lady down hardcore. Just grinding on every last nerd I have. Bruce Wayne. Worrying isn't going to help Alfred. We need to focus. You're right. Let's get started. Yeah. Alfred keeps adjusting his glasses. The reflection. He's making sure I see the reflection in his glasses. Good job, Alfred. He knows the bad computer can use multiple reflection angles to recreate the room that he's in. And I can view the virtual image using my cowl. Good thinking, Alfred. For the smart smart man. Okay, Lucius. Freeze frame on the first signal Alfred gives. Paint us a picture. Here we go. Professional grade camera. Probably came from the Gazette's office. Stairs leading up. Cement walls. We're in a basement. Yep. Alfred's trying to look at things that might give us a clue to where he's being held. He's wounded. Must be one of the thugs Alfred fought upstairs. Okay, looks like we've seen all there is to see in this frame. Let's move on to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Rogers Plumbing. A service company for the water heater. I can use yeah. their records to find home addresses for their clients. We're getting closer. Yeah, but we're not there yet. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Let's keep looking. Nothing else to see here. Moving on. A mason stamp. Only one Masonic lodge in the city. Gotham City Fraternal Order of Stonemasons. So the know. house was built in 1945 by them. Yep. That's a Makes big sense. lead. Lady Arkham. Keep searching. Jump to Alfred's next signal. <sighs> you got it. A basement window. What's that outside? Bus stop. They're by a bus stop. There we go. Okay, I think we Perfect. have to pinpoint a location. We well, are hope. going to uh, go save Alfred. These are all the homes serviced by this water heater company on the days and months listed. 
I can get the bus line from this, but no stop number. This will help pinpoint the neighborhood. Okay, filtering for all homes built on that date. And residents. Bowling alley. <sighs> Damn it. Let's keep looking. You are not going to believe this. Found it! What is it? Lady Arkham is back at the Vale House, where she Crushes. killed her foster parents. Crushes. According to its records, it has a basement. We know where Alfred is, but I'm without a working bat suit. Actually. Woohoo! New bat suit! Thank you, Lucius. It has basic cowl functionality. But outside of that, it's gonna be Batman. It protect much more than your identity. Actual, factual Batman. Good call. Thank you, Lucius. Let's do it. It doesn't have all the bells and whistles. Doesn't need it. But it should still scare the crap out of criminals. Yeah. This I'm Batman tonight. Yeah, buddy. Let's go save Alfred, shall we? Bale Residence, 8.38 p.m. Cross this. There's a trip wire, yeah. Heading into the basement. There's a trip wire, yeah. I'm gonna step on it. I can't not. I'm all right. I saw that. They're gone. No Great. There. No Alfred. Damn it. There's blood on the walls. I'm going to see what I can find. I'm going to murder the crap out of her. Hasn't congealed yet. Means we can't be far behind them. Look at the chair. This is where they had Alfred. Where they beat him. So angry about it. Uh huh. There's a boot print in the blood. Lady Arkham's soldiers dragged him. The trail stops at the wall. Actually, goes under it. Goes under it. Sounds like there's more to this basement than it would appear. It doesn't need closer it. look. The wall is just a facade. Why would the Vales have a false wall in their basement? Here we go. Now let's find out where the Vales were hiding. Boom! Batman's home. It was a small room. With a hole in the floor. A rope ladder. Anyone down there would be trapped. I'm going inside. It's not like creepy, really quickly. Ooh. Bruce, what's down there? Do you see Alfred? No. Ooh. Some kind of torture chamber. Shackles, belts, blood. What? Vicky, uh, she was kept down here, locked away. Who mm. could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. What is there to understand? To willfully hurt a child? It's why she killed the Vales. They yeah. abused her. I'm not saying what she did was right, but... But... I can't imagine Ooh. what she went through. 
The Vale's foster children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. Bloody scratches, fingernails. Someone tried to climb out. Alfred? No. No. That's a creepy Stop. doll. Vicky created her here, in this room. This is where Vicky Vale became Lady Arkham. Yep, makes sense. The belt. It's caked in blood. Ugh. Not Alfred's glasses. What's wrong with you? Alfred's glasses. How's he gonna see? He left us a message though. There's chalk there. Fresh blood. This blood is fresher than the rest. Must be Alfred's. Shackles. Blood on them. Old. And new. Vicky did to Alfred what was done to her. Delightful. There are drawings. Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different. Newer. Alfred drew a thing. Alfred drew a thing. Look at the One chalk. piece apart from the others. That color. Look at that color. Mm. The same color as my tech. Can't be a coincidence. Maybe... The highlighted words read to, to Arkham. Arkham. That drawing looks like Alfred. Took Alfred Arkham. Alfred left me another clue. This is what he wanted me to find. To see. Because we're going back to Arkham Asylum. Own Lady Arkham drawings to include himself. And these two words. To Arkham. The chief. Going to Arkham and she's taking Alfred with her. Great. Super. It's the final piece. Super to do. Just She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems. Including Arkham Asylum. Yeah. She's going to open the doors. Release the inmates, and she took Alfred with her. Joy. Warden of the GCPD. I'm on it. Lady Arkham won't be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. Maybe for lucky. Hopefully we're lucky. Arkham Asylum, 12:15 a.m. My, that's an imposing-looking building. I like the drift that Batman just did. I like the little song puppet dude. It's pretty cool. Everything good? Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it then. The children of Arkham have taken over. Lieutenant Gordon says the GCPD are on their way. Oh, it's like He's Arkham the Asylum. Oh, really? If you can yeah, find yeah. Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Yeah. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. Go ahead. I got this. Oh, you got nothing, Jack Pal. You got nothing. You're about to be hung up. That was nice. Batman. This ends now, Vicky. Tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his pink. Answer the question. Where he is doesn't matter. Where are the drugs? Better not be. Another bad. corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. Killing him won't solve anything. But it will teach Bruce Wayne a lesson. When he and all of Gotham. I don't know that that's true. Look the other way. Not again. 
I don't know if that's true. And when did Gotham look away from you, Vicky? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea what I've done to come this far. I do, actually. Too much to turn back now. I've been to your home. I've seen where the Bales kept you. People like them. They deserve to be behind bars. Behind bars? They deserved and got far worse than that. Even if they did, no one else needs to die. You're wrong! Your time's run out! Oh! Oh, man. Vicky! There's nothing you can do, Batman. You underestimate the true children of Arkham. These souls kept behind bars. Open the doors! Crap! Arkham! Listen to me! Freedom is yours! The only one standing in your way is Batman. Is Batman. Yeah, I knew that was good. Batman. He stuck me in here! Me too. Let me out of He's the crazy one. Oh, there's a guy from earlier in the game as well. Strike! Oh! Look who it is! It's Harvey! It was Harvey! Woo! There you go! Yep. The highest security systems offline. Yep. Every inmate's loose. The yep. leader of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went. That away. Put them that away. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna go. Let's get in the sand. All right, woman. Cause enough trouble. We're going down. You're not getting away, Vicky. Well, I only have a select amount of time to do each one. Uh, given much longer, we'll cut the orderly's trachea. Next. About to gut the defenseless orderly. Table to lay the arc. Go time! Go time! Go bow! Go shang! Go tow! And have a table! Yes! In the face! Oh. Oh, guys. That's the plan. Yeah, that sucks, doesn't it? Thank you, Gordon. You're going to die. Oh, Gordon's got some moves. Suplex through the table. Ba-bow. Oh, 
Oh, hey, Joker. Truly inspiring. What's up, Such buddy? Such a pleasure to see your work in person. <sighs> Jesus. Uh, okay. Sure. Thank you, officers. Gordon's here. We'll round up the rest of the inmates. You stop Lady Arkham. Got it. Thank you. Bye. It's getting intense, guys. Oh, hi, dude. Have fun swinging the door. There's no way out now. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak uh... through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. All right, then. That was exciting. Uh, not fun. Oh, look at your little hover boots. Great. Vicky! This is just so... Uh... <laughs> You're not well, Vicky. No, she's not. You need professional help. <laughs> Says the man dressed as a bat. <sighs> Let him go. The butler has to die. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. For Thomas Wayne's sins. He took away my family, so uh, I'll take away his son. Good logic. If you really want to save the butler, bring me Bruce Wayne. If anyone can find him, it's you. He's probably cowering behind a 12-inch thick wall and a hundred bodyguards right now. I'll bring you Wayne, but first, let Alfred Pennyworth go. No, no, no. Afraid he's too useful to do that just yet. You're doing so much for one old man. Man. Come on now. Good try. Stop playing games. This isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? I've done great things for Gotham. No. Nah. Tony and Hill deserved to die. No. Nah. If anything, I did you a favor. I don't know about that. We're fighting the same fight, Batman. No, we're not. Can't you see that? Those men deserved their day in court, just like everyone. So they could have gotten off like they did so many times before? No, Batman. They got exactly what they deserved. My justice is final and absolute. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than Spock? He hides behind his status and wealth. He's a coward, leaving other men to carry his burden. You aren't my enemy. You're bad at traps, lady. You're really bad at traps. <sighs> I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. No, I don't think it was. What about you? Do you wear the mask to hide? Or to become uh, who you really are? I wear the mask to hide. Kinda. Are you the man? Or the mask? The mask is a symbol. Some fear it. But for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. Yeah. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. 
Ist das so? Dodging all the stuff. Come on. Crushed it, Alfred. Man, man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. It's all right. Did you see where she went? She just dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Above you. <laughs> Interesting how you speak to him. So familiar, Alfred. <sighs> Such concern for someone you've never met before. It's called compassion, Vicky. Something you seem to know very little. <laughs> it sounds like deflection to me. There's more here than you're telling. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only one way to find out. <laughs> that man. Don't you? Shut up, old man. You've seen my true self. Your turn. Prove that you care. Take off your mask. Let me see the man you uh. You're only a piece in the bigger game, but you're the only piece I have left. Cut your monologue, woman. Ooh, Alfred. <laughs> Let's go. Bring it. Bring it on, Picky. No more lies. No more talk. The only truth left is in your death. Okay, yeah, if you want to say that, sure. But I but ow. But ow. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I'll bury you. I don't think you will. Ow. It's gonna come down. Turn on me, you? Throw the pillar. Eat it. Broke your staff in half. Eat it. Stop, Vicky. It's over. Nothing will keep me from my revenge. Not the pillars, girl. Into the pillar again. Dodge that one. Dodge that one. That one. That one. That one. So many prompts. So many prompts right now. Oh, and I got my ultimate. Oh, in the face! Waka! On the table. Find my special, please. Yeah. 
Man. Let's fall apart. You belong in this darkness, Beth. I don't know what I gotta do. You and the butler. Alright, well, I'll guess that again. Boom! Going down. Bye bye, lady. Alright, it's time to get out of here and get out of there. Let's go, Batman. Let's go. Go, go, go. Get out of there. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. Move it, move it, move it. Stop it for you, woman. Oh, she's dead. Let's get out of here then. I believe. All right. I think we made it. I think we made it. That was insane. I think we made it. A week later. As to last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. Yep. <sighs> If the public knew the half of it, Alfred, it's better that they don't. I've got a badass eye patch. It's unsigned. Selena. Aww. It's all right, Alfred. Alfred, here. Let, let me help. No, no, don't. With. Everything that's been going on, I, I, uh, I haven't yet thanked you, Bruce. You've saved my life. Eh, you saved I've mine. no doubt Miss Vale would have killed me had you not arrived when you did. But the fact remains, in my state, I'm not of much use to you. It'll take time to adjust, and I'm afraid it may interfere with my butler duties. Alfred, what happened to you? It's my fault. Yep. Lady Arkham only went after you because of me. Yep. You have supported me my entire life, and I failed to protect you. I've known the risks for some time now. I don't blame you. But thank you, Bruce. I promise you, I will use everything at my disposal to help you. Oh. Well, sure. I mean, the silver's not going to polish itself, is it? <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. Lady Arkham, Penguin, or Harvey. They won't be the last to threaten No, they Gotham. won't. Likely not, but you'll be ready. In the meantime, let us hope for some peace. To peace. The damage done by the children of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent terror that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen, but experts agree that... Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Leaders like you. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is, and let them know what you Absolutely. plan to do for his future. Absolutely. Well, this could be a first start. For you, and for this city. Well done.
Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud oh, of. Thank you, Alfred. I'm honored to call my friend. And I'm honored to call you my butler and friend. Thank you, Alfred. So, what do you intend to do about tonight? Oh, uh, well. Lucius has yet to invent a suit that will let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. <laughs> I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Bruce, you could help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. Uh... Perhaps one is truly the mask. And one is who you truly believe you are. Let Gordon know. Oh, goes Bruce. Bruce Wayne will be there. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Prisms! Maybe she said prisons, but it sounded like she said prisons. He's here. Commissioner Gordon. It doesn't Yay, sound like right. you have your title now. Now everything's Don't worry. set for the second one. It will. Because there's a the second one. There's a second season. Commission. And as soon as I can get it, honest, I want to get it and I want to play it for you guys. Because this was awesome. Now after that nasty business at your manor. Yeah, I know. I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. Yeah. Lost like that. I wouldn't blame you for lying low. He's also a jerk. What you and did it wasn't is no secret. Himself. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Public opinion is bound to swing around. Before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. These people have no idea who Bruce Wayne really is. But that's about to change. Oh? Well, I look forward to knowing the real Bruce Wayne as well. I was half hoping Batman might show up, too. And I wouldn't mind knowing he was keeping an eye on things here. If Batman isn't here, it's because he's more needed somewhere else. I wouldn't take it personally. <laughs> Good advice when it comes to that guy. <laughs> They're ready for you, Commissioner. Now, during times like these, it can feel impossible to hold on to hope. But I have hope. Hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Now in the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community yeah. band together to fight those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Thank you, Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm here today to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses. And some of those losses came at the hands of my own father, or at least as a result of his actions. I would like to take this opportunity to apologize. To tell you how sorry I am for the pain the Wayne family has caused this community. If my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, yeah. it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. No, we didn't really sit on the sidelines my of that family either, but so. was built on the suffering of others. Which I did not know about. I think it's time to repay that debt. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of its citizens better. Right on. And to that end, a closer alliance between the GCPD and Wayne Enterprises 
will provide the police force with the support, with the training, and the equipment they need to make Gotham safer than it ever has been before. Yeah, I'm not putting money on this will be the most technologically advanced police force in the country because the people of Gotham deserve to feel safe. What the? Oh no. Who was that? Clear the area. Who was that? Faster to lock up. Just minutes ago. Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. Uh, uh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> That's the end, I think. I think we've done it. Yeah, that was the end. We beat it. We've officially beaten. Telltale, Batman, the Telltale series. Uh, did you subscribe to Penguin? Yes, I did. Did you blame Alfred? I'm doing comfort in... Yeah, 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 yeah. Just found Selena. One of the thief, yeah. Take out the cow. Yeah! Not a lot of people did. Hmm. And, okay. Alright. Right on! Cool. Pretty good. That was pretty awesome. Season overview. Analyzing your performance. We got a season overview. Merciful. It takes a heroic it takes heroic restraint when dealing with criminals, keeping oneself from taking too far and inflicting unnecessary pain and suffering. Col cunning. 59% cunning. 85% collaborative. 84% compassionate. That's cool. I didn't know that I actually measured everything. Right on. Well. That is it for season one of Telltale's Batman. Um, hopefully we can get around to doing season two because I'd really like to do that for you guys. Please like, comment, subscribe if you enjoy the content. Check out our Patreon, check out our Discord. And as always, thank you so, so much for watching. This has been awesome, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Till next time, bye bye <laughs>